Don't flop, hey, birthday leads. If you're in the building, make a bit of noise. Yeah. On the right hand side is an absolute legend in Don't Flop. Make a bit of noise for old Shay. Yeah. And on the left hand side. On the left hand side, making his return to the league since his battle with Big J at Sunburn, make a better noise for one. Yeah. It's a three round battle. O'Shea won the flip and decided he wanted to start off the eighth birthday, so it's round number one on O'Shea. Let's go. Let's get this straight from the start. I am without a doubt the hardest battle rapper on this card. What I don't need to tell you, you all be knowing that. So after I knock Matt Hoffer the fuck out. People, please stop gassing him. First time I met him, I said, Juan, what's happening, my G? What's been happening? This smarmy cunt just went, oh, exams, been passing. <laughs> <laughs> education, education is for dickheads. Listen. <laughs> Shit, but I'd rather be dumb as shit and actually touch the tit. <laughs> your mother is Harry Baker. Your father, your father is Dan Schrader. Fuck a battle. Listen, fuck a battle. Backbreaker, big man, nice off the top. I'm Van Vader. <laughs> do, you, do you think those wrestling references were irrelevant? Well, I do too. But just remember, I'm twice the man you are, and I have half the brain that you do. Listen, listen. One, your bitch ass whiter than a massive bear poo. No lies, you cry. No lies, you cry watching Planet Earth 2. No one cares. No one cares how bad your bars are when you have a care few. You bounce into the barbers and go, the faggot's her, dude. I, I swear, listen, I swear you look like one of those kids who suffers from all sorts of allergy types. Listen, every hot day in summer, half your family dies. Listen, oh, scout your school with a Stanley knife. You are the English stereotype on Family Guy. Listen, <laughs> listen, no. listen, I'm unprepared, I don't care. You're getting mullered, killed there. Before you left your house for this event, your father said, there won't be any collards, will there? <laughs> Ideas are nightmares for one's parents. <laughs> Whose worst fear is one with dyed hair and he likes earrings? <laughs> like, whatever they say has no bearing. One, darling. Fuck off, mother, I'm preparing. <laughs> what? What? I'm, I'm screw facing the mirror. It's not just normal staring. I mean, the amount of money you've spent on my education, maybe you should start fucking learning. <laughs> yes, listen. So, what is shite? Dead to hype, he has his own ethnicity, extra white. <laughs> <laughs> Yo. Your chick get my dick stiffer than a Scott Steiner wrestling fight. <laughs> you, you look like you watch University Challenge with the sand down and still get all the fucking questions right. <laughs> Getting off on O'Shea, I was in awe and shock. I finally had a chance 
to war with God. I don't vlog legend, I was flattered. What had I done to afford this shot? So I checked out your recent battles, each of which I thought to watch, but then I sort of stopped. You had a battle with orcs. That's a little more than odd. Half an hour battle with Bard. That was unorthodox. <laughs> You're battling Bobby Rex next month. This guy sure performs a lot. Wait, you did a two on two with Bloodstroke. Oh, how the fuck do I call this off? <laughs> Did you accept so many battles? You know your habit's getting dangerous when you forget that you're battling until you get invited on the Facebook event. <laughs> <laughs> you know when some guy at work's leaving and you've seen him like twice before but everyone's writing goodbye messages so you think they're outside and sure and it's the equivalent of that every time this fucking guy performs because you put your name on the card when you've got no idea who you're writing for. <laughs> Whoa, O'Shea? He's got loads of fame. I better think of something dope to say. I uh, name me, you thought lanky, blonde, and big teeth. Time for those Harry Baker throwaways. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not Harry. Oh, I'm not Harry. So those comparisons incredibly shit. It's Juan. What? Dope flops heart throb since Carlos left her a bit. <laughs> I'm the pangest at this, ever so pissed. Even Harry Keep going! Don't since Carlos left her a bit. I'm the pangest at this, ever so pissed. Even heretic's complexion is jealous of this. You battle a middle class blonde guy at every birthday. <laughs> From what I remember, you were debatable with Harry, the twist left you bodied and severed, and now you've got me. Your future's looking older than ever, to be Frank Ocean ready for another blonde on his racket. Was an O'Shea Stella performance? That's a Coke Bud, Mandy and Stella performance, but it's getting old. We still see your jaw swinging at every event you roll. But you thought you would have learned but you thought you would have learned after that heroin the gem had sold, but you're still getting lines off different plugs like Della Soul. Mm. Oh, she got a son now, so that shit's tragic. You know it's a bit backwards when he hasn't said his first word, but spells out MDMA with fridge language. <laughs> Making him upset. Better start thinking about changing the subject. How about we talk about the Myverse battle when you said that you came on your son's head? Because <laughs> <laughs> since, since then, you can't tell if it's tears or calm when he's starting to cry. <laughs> that, that's not eczema on his face, it's just last month's supply that's hardened and dry. <laughs> He's been feeling a lot darker inside. Your son's like Harry Potter, because what you left on his forehead scarred him for life. Yeah! You chose to go first in this battle, because that's some shit you couldn't help but address. There was no point in flipping a coin, because with O's every toss seems to end up on heads. <laughs> and your son's called Finley. And your son's called Finley. Finley. For that I don't have any bars. I just think that is a laugh that you haven't covered a fin like that since the last time you shot. <laughs> Shit about the MD MDMA fridge ma magnets was exceptionally poo because my son can spell e cocaine and ecstasy too. <laughs> listen, listen, that shit was funny as fuck. 
You're really cool with a pen. Congratulations, you don't flop half from in a room full of men. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, when I heard I was battling one at the eighth birthday, I thought I best come through with some great wordplay. So here it goes. My cock will make a gay. Listen, <laughs> homo bars. You go to homo bars. One, you are a homo. Bars. Kick your ass from here back to Oxford. Sing it down so quick you will smash your coccyx. <laughs> I have never heard anyone that obnoxious. Oh, what's this? That's an ostrich. <laughs> But the stupid shit I do, there's a better demand. I'm not the sharpest tool in the box, I'm an Everton fan. Plus, I hear about my cock, I am one hell of a man. Listen, <laughs> scalp, scalp your skull with a Stanley knife. You can marvel at this comic shit like a Stanley knife. Listen, your whole, your whole style is wetter than a fucking handy wipe. I've seen you, I've seen you legless off of ice on some Bambi shite. Listen, does your mother know what you got up to at the seventh birthday last year? When your jaw was swinging from here to here. Here to here. It was swinging from here to here. I looked and thought a three year old on crack, dear oh dear. Listen, you are the definition of a transgender. You had, you had one pull of a spliff and looked like you'd been on a three month crack bender. Listen, you look like Prometheus as Michael Fassbender. When, when we have charades and it's you, use this hand gesture here. One step up, up. Listen, your mum seen my cock and said, fuck yeah, it's great. My ball skills so good, I can nutmeg a snake. Listen. <laughs> And bump heads, it's it's fate. Because O'Shea be Jake Miller chief. You look like you helped create WikiLeaks. Listen. <laughs> wow. He has you you have a gay Twitter feed, and I'll kick you a thousand times in an eight millipede! <laughs> Is when two can takes a poo. Listen, <laughs> I hate you, I hate you, and I hate your crew. You ordered mastermind on pay per view. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, when most people encounter a shark. <laughs> <laughs> When most people encounter a shark, it's when they plan to see the world. When you first encountered a shark, you got banned from Sea World. <laughs> banned from Sea World. But when I start getting personal and give them heat, you'll start having flashbacks to that shark again. Because this is where shit gets deep. Because we all love Flossie, and your love seems like the strongest link. But since your relationship, innuendo's been on a cocaine and vodka team. <laughs> Friendship with him died the moment that you got it in. You put your boo over Mike like Sully in Monsters Inc. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, there, there must have been another girl who let you blow in a box. You worked at Morrison's. You should have been getting offers all over the shop. <laughs> Now your friendship with Mike all ripped at the seams you called floss and managed to slip in between through the skin of your teeth. You treated that friendship like that shark that you fit in your schemes, you shit on it, forgetting that there's plenty other fish in the sea. Oh. Listen to me, Steve. <laughs> <laughs> You're fucking backstabbing Judas. Not because of innuendo and I'll hold your breath. But because he's been friends with Blood Show for years but still hasn't taught him to multi yet. <laughs> How does it feel having Blood Show send you bars? And you have to fake it like, great job. <laughs> Don't worry, I feel your pain. I do the same with my main role. <laughs> We have the two worst sidemen in Battle Rap. 
<laughs> Those two need to know their place. But just because Rob's shit yeah. doesn't mean his guns won't blow today. Rob will run upon you at Morrison's. He'll probably be, be putting cokes away. He'll catch you in the juice aisle. That's where he'll find ocean spray. <laughs> loves his gun bars. Yeah, we'll blast the Glock. A Morrison's worker slash shooter. Boy, are you hard or what? But even Morrison's let you go. Left you on your ass to rot. So the only time Steele get fired in Liverpool is at his next supermarket job. But I was halfway through writing these flames until I realised there's no point trying today when he's gonna shout, yeah, after every line that I say. <laughs> knock, knock. Who's there? An interrupting O'Shea. An interrupting ah! <laughs> things, have, things have changed since the way you used to spray rhymes, though. Back when crowds of ten cheered over race type jokes, but the shark shit is no longer the great white hope. It's too. It's too. It's 2016, you idiot. We don't Google it. We Siri it. <laughs> Spitting your Liverpool in jokes. We know you work hard, but you shouldn't have to get a search bar up and search bars up. You want to find O'Shea? Google map Liverpool and search bars up. Mm. Um, <laughs> fuck it, two rounds in. Your guy cheap is hungry, want to get a round up? How about you try being funny? I guess Mr. Google it didn't quite see me coming. The result could be anything, but I'm feeling lucky. And that's <laughs> Stopping the grind. Listen, I got sacked from Morrison's because I was fucking robbing it blind. <laughs> Listen, I will punch man in his big dome. The only good bar in your fucking base was my man's ringtone. <laughs> Liverpool, this is uncertain, I'm prepared for you lot. 
But you want to stop getting called a Scouse thief? Stop wearing Lacoste. <laughs> Lions represent courage, a reminder of white and never scared. Swans represent beauty and grace, an angelic flair. Dogs, dogs represent companionship, because real friendship's rare, and Lacoste crocodiles represent shoplifters everywhere. They put a kid that's fucking amazing against a Liverpudlian racist. Now I'm just playing, writing race bars for you, I didn't get any joy. But you want to stop getting called a Scouse racist? Stop wearing Henry Lloyd. <laughs> the clothes represent character. They tell us who you really are, G. You might wear the top hat if you're extremely balmy. You might wear cargoes if you're mean and hardy. You might wear Henry Lloyd if you're a neo-Nazi. <laughs> I'm sorry. I really, really, really didn't want to par Liverpool. But look at his clothes, hair, pint and accent. You are Liverpool. <laughs> To any, to, any, to any international fans, yeah, you know our seizure. You want to learn about Liverpool, there's not loads to teach you. Just take two or three seconds to look at O'Shea's features. I know, right? I wouldn't want to go there either. <laughs> this event's not fancy dress. You made an easy mistake. But even so, a JD sale rap, that is genius, man. <laughs> But when O starts clowning you, he usually starts with a freestyle about your shoes where he literally just states the brand but says nothing else about the shoes. Like, look at you, you're wearing Nikes, you virgin. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, this guy's observant. Good to know that your eyes are working. <laughs> yeah, you were here from the beginning and we watched your comedy rap watching you now is just like watching a zombie popping up back. So those shoe freestyles are fitting now that Flop doesn't want this to act. Because you started from the ground up only to make a mockery of the brand. Mm. But your attitude to battling is similar to how it is with drugs. When you start lacking substance, you know you've got to pick it up, but you come down hard every time you get a little buzz and just keep going when you know it's time to give it up. So give it up. Um, now you can tell by the state of the bars I'm using that I spent more time shitting than preparing for this do. So for the next 10 seconds, I'm just going to stare at this fruit. 